Mississippi and Washington, D.C. share many good things, but none better than former Redskins kicker Robert Kayat. <laughs> Chancellor, thank you and all your colleagues for hosting the first 2008 presidential debate. In the next few minutes, you're going to hear from a small number of people who will tell you about the very many, many people whose hard work made tonight possible. You will also be hearing from our moderator a little bit about the rules of the road for a live television broadcast. And finally, you will be asked about 700 times to please turn off any kind of mechanical, electrical, or other instrument you might have brought in. So you might want to take the first opportunity and, and do that now. I want to start by introducing the co-chairman of the Commission on Presidential Debates, Paul Kirk and Frank Ferenkoff. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, what a great hall this is. Uh, this is a uh, obviously a night of history for the nation. It's a night of history for Ole Miss, and it's a night of history for the Commission on Presidential Debates. Our mission is very straightforward. In two words, it's called voter education, and. Uh, what the Commission does is to guarantee that there would be debates between the leading candidates for President and Vice President of the United States in each of our general election cycles. Uh, what you all know is what the voters know, that this uh, choice in 2008 will be pivotal uh, for the future of our nation. The stakes could not be higher. The issues have seldom been more complex, and the voter interest has never, at least in my memory, been more intense. 30-second spots don't do it, but debates and an exchange between the leading candidates under a format that the Commission has introduced this year will allow for a more expansive and instructive dialogue and to enlighten and illuminate folks about the serious choices before us and the complexities that face the nation. And so we are delighted to be a part of that process. We have been for many years and delighted, of course, to be here at a night of history for uh, this great university. In our audience tonight are three of the board, members of our board of directors. Uh, the full board is uh, listed in your program, a very distinguished group. But with us this evening is United States Senator Jack Danforth, former United States Senator, uh, Antonio Hernandez, and Dorothy Ridings. Uh, I want to say a word on behalf of the uh, woman who introduced me, Janet Brown, who on a day-to-day -day basis, her uh, excellence and leadership and accomplishment have made the uh, Commission on Presidential Debates a permanent fixture and among the institutions in, a, in our democracy, and she's done a great job for it. So a little round of applause. Uh, everyone in this audience has 